Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So throughout the course of last year, when Google was initially rolling out the Chrome UI refresh design and layout changes to the desktop browser, I was letting you know about a up and coming developing feature where you can organize your tabs using AR as part of the Chrome UI refresh 2023. And I did post quite a lot of content on that. So if you want more info, just do a search for organized tabs uh, in Chrome on the channel if you'd like some more info. Now, when I posted those previous videos, I could never show you in real time what the feature is all about. And just to let you know now that the ability to organize tabs using AR from tab search is now available in Chrome Canary 129. Well, it's rolled out anyway in my region where the flags previously were not available. So now I can actually show you in real time and give you a hands-on as to more or less what this feature will be if and when it does roll out to an up-and-coming stable version. And organized tabs using AI is not available uh, in stable as yet. Now, as you may well know, um, in Chrome, if you want to organize your tabs into groups, you have to do it manually. So this is where the AI side of things will obviously automatically use artificial intelligence to organize and rearrange your tabs. So first of all, uh, if you are running Chrome Canary 129 and haven't been able to get this feature working, what you can do now is head up to your Omnibox as always, and we head over to our experimental flags page by entering chrome colon forward slash forward slash flags into the Omnibox. And I've already enabled the flags because there are five in total that need to be enabled. So just to kind of cut to the chase, um, if you just type in tab, in my case, but I'll leave um, the five uh, flags uh, down below in the description for you to copy and paste. So in my case, I'm just going to enter tab, and here are the five flags that are available. First one, tab organization. Enables the auto tab groups feature which can be found within the tab search bubble. Tab organization settings visibility. Show tab organization in the settings you are. Multi-tab organization enables auto-tab group suggestions for multiple tab groups at once. Tab reorganization enables auto-tab groups suggestions for adding tabs to existing groups. And the final and fifth one, tab reorganization divider. Shows a divider in auto-tab group suggestions for existing groups indicating which tabs in the group are new. So those are the five flags you have to enable as mentioned. Those will be be down below in the description. So once you've enabled all of those, um, you obviously will have to restart uh, Chrome Canary to apply those flags. And now I've just got two um, tabs open. And if I head up to my search tabs in the uh, to the top left of the browser, you'll see now organized tabs. So over and above all tabs, we have organized tabs. And it says stay organized with tab groups. You can check the, for tab group suggestions anytime and check now. And that's grouping your tabs using AR. And I'm just using a basic example just to give you guys a general idea. So that's used AR. And it says tab group suggested. And there you go, YouTube videos. You can clear that and you can create group. But just take note here. It says your tab titles and URLs are sent to Google and may be seen by human reviewers to improve this feature. So obviously just take note of that. And it also says like all things AR, this is an experimental AR feature and won't always get it right. So... I'm going to create group, and there we go. There's my YouTube videos tab group that's been automatically created using artificial intelligence. And if you want to ungroup that or delete the group, you just right-click on that, and I'm just going to go ungroup. Now, something else you can also do is you can right-click on any tab, and you'll also see now in the right-click context menu, organize similar tabs, which is a quicker way kind of to do it uh, if you'd like to do so, there you go, group in your tabs, and the same applies, create groups. So you get the general idea. So just wanted to uh, put it out there because, um, as mentioned, I can now finally show you this in real time and give you a, a basic hands-on. And as yet, no mention of this making its way to stable. And at this stage, um, not too much when it comes to AR has actually made its way into the stable version. A lot of the AI is still taking place in preview and mainly in Canary. So this could be an indication, obviously, that um, Google is wanting to follow suit after Microsoft Edge and bring a lot of AR into the browser. But um, as I get info, like in this case, the, those five flags has be, have become available in Chrome Canary 129. Obviously, 
Um, I'll keep you updated if I get any more info regarding this feature. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.